The siege happened without warning. Wait a minute. When was this? 200 years ago. <sighs> Ancient history. Some of us would like to hear how the story ends. Appearing off the coast of Griffin Rock, the pirate ship known as the Oaken Crow fired its cannons. Its band of buccaneers then came ashore to pillage the town, setting everything ablaze. The most irreplaceable of the booty stolen that day was the settler's bell, which had hung in the lighthouse tower ever since the town's founding in 1649. The loss continues to be felt to this day. As for the pirates... Please tell me they were pursued across the high seas and brought to justice. Uh, I'll have to finish later, guys. Oh. Well, that is disappointing. One more chapter, please! Can't. My lad pioneer troop has a rehearsal for the Founders' Day ceremony tomorrow. We're honoring the accomplishments of the early settlers. Accomplishments? Working together to build something new. We arrived, we survived, and we thrived. Cool motto, huh? Setting up camp on a pretty island hardly seems worth remembering. Humans spend too much time thinking about the past. You're missing the point. See? Cody? Coming! Uh, I was just explaining Founder's Day to the bots and... About that. I'm afraid the ceremony's on hold. Storm's about to make landfall. Aww. All right, team. We need to button down the town. Blades, what'd you do? Walk the whole way? Had to. See? Blades, were you damaged in the light of duty? Yes, I was. Threw myself in the path of an airplane. Saved a young man. A young man who got all gooshy eyes with Danny. He did not. Gooshy eyes? Sounds painful. Oh, we'll have Graham straighten that rotor out when we get home. Now that I know a bell is supposed to be in that tower, it looks kind of empty. The town just never felt right about installing a replacement. Why not? Then everyone could quit moping and get on with their lives. The original bell was special, Heatwave. It needs to be remembered, not replaced. I understand perfectly. People gather on Founders Day to share their anger over the theft of personal property. Well, not exactly. So what did happen to the pirates after they took off with the bell? They sailed into a storm that was probably a lot like this one. Nobody ever heard from them again. All right, everyone. After we secure the marina, we should be done. Was it to stack containers four high? Double time it, team! Are you all right? I 
I think so. But we're drifting away from the island. We'll find you. I promise. Dad, you're breaking up. We are approaching the limit of communication range. Chief, don't worry. We'll keep Cody safe. Stay strong. We can't do anything. It's too unsafe for any boat out there. Or plane. We can trust the bots. Cody will be fine. As soon as the storm breaks, we'll grab him. The storm is finally passing. More like we're passing out of the storm. Griffin Rock is still getting hammered. That means no search party. We could be out here drifting for days. Or weeks. Or 12 minutes, 17 seconds. Assuming we maintain our current rate of speed, of course. It looks uninhabited. You know what this makes us? Inhabitants? Castaways! Isn't that cool? You know what would be even cooler? If my rotor weren't bent, then I could fly for help. So what's our next move? What we promised the Chief. We keep Cody safe. But who's going to keep us safe? Huh, this should work. Work for what? A shelter. Fresh water, dry ground, and close enough to the beach to watch for passing ships. Ah, uh, shelter. Right. One shelter coming up. Rescue bots, roll to the rescue. I'm afraid this is a job for heavy machinery. Why don't you rest up, Cody? Over near the stream, perhaps. Safely out of harm's way. Hmm, we'll need rocks, mud, logs. More primitive materials than I'm used to. Should be interesting. predator with a taste for helicopters. No doubt our presence here has unsettled the indigenous wildlife. It's coming for us! We tell no one of this. Agreed. Wrong from nature's resources, yet with all the soothing comforts of home. We call it Island Fortress. Oh. Island flawed. I knew it wouldn't work. It's okay, guys. I built my own. Simple, yet functional. How'd you learn how to build that? Lad pioneers. See? It does pay to learn how things were done in the past. And that quaint campfire. Heat caused by a little friction and a lot of patience. I want to be a lad pioneer. You can be a bot pioneer when we get home. But right now, it's about dinner time, so... Food. You need food. Rescue bots, roll to the rescue. Wait. Guys! Ah. <sighs> Where are all the... What are the creatures called? Clams. The book I read said they live in the sand. Maybe we have to dig deeper. Gotcha. I scored an egg! Ah! Ah! Sorry! 
I understand these are quite a delicacy in France. Guys, you wouldn't believe the number of fish in that stream! Um, I'm confused. Did we roll to the rescue or did Cody? Don't feel bad. You tried. Hey, you know what I really need? Firewood! Ah, toasty. Need anything else? No, I'm good. So, uh, what would a bot pioneer do next? Uh, we could tell spooky stories. I know a good one. Five friends went into a dark and creepy forest. Fire needs more wood. Wait, do you see what that is? Um, oak? It's a crow, like the figurehead on the pirate ship. The one that took your bell? Could those pirates have been shipwrecked on this island? If their storm was of equal magnitude to ours, it is quite feasible. You know what this means? The pirates are still here! Not after 200 years, but if their ship is still here, the bell could be too. Where'd you find that wood? Up a ridge, a hundred meters that way. Let's check it out! Whoa, hold on, Mr. Pioneer. It's too treacherous up there, even with our lights. He waves right. We'll look in the morning. Besides, five friends going into a dark and creepy forest? I don't want to be someone else's campfire story. Okay. Cody, do you read? Cody Burns, can you hear me? Dad. Don't worry. With this many volunteers searching, we'll find them. All right. This is where we found most of the firewood. Spread out. Look for anything that could have come from the ship. my altimeter settles. What did we just fall through? A secret hatchway built by the pirates! Cody! You had us worried. Are you hurt? I'm fine, but you will never believe what I found. Take a look. Unbelievable. The Oaken Crow. Astonishing. It looks like it came in through there, but then was blocked in. Probably from a rock slide. Come on! Let's see if the bell's on board. You thinking what I'm thinking? Yes. No. What are you thinking? This is the reason the pirates were never heard from again. They never got off the island. So? There's a high probability we'll never get off the island either. That's not what I was thinking. Until now. True work of art. Sitting here all this time just waiting to be found. A splendid discovery, Cody. I can't believe the settler's bell can finally return home. What's wrong? It's just that no telling how long we'll be marooned here. It's a big ocean and a rather small island. Come on, guys. Bot pioneers are not allowed to lose hope. We have to be resourceful, just like the early settlers. What are we doing? Cody's right. We shouldn't be giving up so easily. We can be resourceful. Perhaps we could build a seaworthy craft and sail ourselves home. Build one? We're standing on one. The Oaken Crow. But she's landlocked. I'm guessing that getting her out was too big of a job for the pirates, but... Not for us. Agreed. While knowing how things were done in the past is helpful, nothing beats a state-of-the-art rescue bot. What do you say, Heatwave? 
I say it's high time we do something for you. Like get you home. Cody, Cody, come in, please. Cody Burns, please come in. They must still be out of range. They could be anywhere. I'll try for a while. Cody, are you there? Please, come in. survived, and we thrived. Avast, me hearties! Hoist the jib and raise the yard arm! Or the other way around! Aye, matey! Set sail for Griffin Rock! Whichever way that is. Understood. Thank you for your efforts. The plane's heading back. It's getting too dark. We'll be losing the other boats soon, too. Come on, buddy. Where are you? <gasps> Do you hear that? It sounds like a bell. It's coming from over there. Cody, can you hear me? Dad? Cody, are you all right? We are! If you're in range, you must be close. Dad, we found the settler's bell. Can you hear it? Settler's Bell? That's not all they found. Look! Oh, I'm so worried about you. Thank you for taking care of Cody. We all took care of each other. Let's Does he have so. a sister? This will require a new chapter to be written in the Griffin Rock history book. Maybe they'll mention us. They better. So, when are we holding our first Bot Pioneers meeting? I nominate myself as troop leader. All in favor? Guys, you are supposed to say I, or just nod. Guys. Coming up on the Hub Family Movie, when a lonely boy befriends a stray dog. Hey, buddy. Buddy! Can I keep him? He discovers the canine has a unique skill. No way. Now Buddy is taking his talents to the court. The Hub Family Movie, Air Bud, tonight at 6 Eastern, 3 Pacific, on the Hub.